I avoided the story. I saw the kid's face, and I saw the... It's, it's heartbreaking. It's fucking insane. And you hear all the stories about kids that were saying that they knew this kid was going to be a, a school shooter anyway. Wow. They were saying in the past uh, that... And one of the things he wrote, he wrote it on Facebook or something, that he wants to be a professional school shooter. Wow. And then two years later, and then he got visited by the FBI. The FBI actually checked this fucking kid out, talked to him about it, and decided he wasn't a threat. How do you decide someone's a threat or not a threat? Hey, ma. Hey, Sam. Are you okay? I'm at McDonald's. Don't judge me. I'm hungry. I wouldn't dream of it. Listen, are you close to being done driving for the day? I could be. Do you need something? ready for me. Okay. So you need me to go to the pharmacy and get you some meds? I can do that. I can duck out early, go get you some meds. Let me ask you something. Do I get any of these meds? You don't want any of these. You mean you're not going to share? Well, that depends. Are you hearing voices in your head? I could be. How do I know if I'm hearing voices in my head? You'd know. Would I? Would I? Well, maybe not. Anyway. All right. Okay, I'll I'll um I'll do one last ride and I'll go get that prescription for you. Okay. Thanks, Sam. Anything else? I love you. Okay, love you too. Bye, bye. It's sad that he, anyone, could do that. It's sad that anyone would be hurting and so fucked up that you could take a child imagine you have a kid right and he's just a cute little fella tiny little baby they don't know anything but a giggle and you tickle them and from there one day that becomes a school shooter oh my god that's what people have to take into consideration a gun-free zone to a maniac because they're all cowards a gun-free zone is let's go in and let's attack because bullets aren't coming back at us and if you uh, new ride request, there we go. If you do this, and a lot of people are talking about it, and certainly five, three, a point that we'll discuss, five, three, lane, but concealed to carry to for teachers and left. for let's get started. Talent of that type of talent. So left. let's say you had 20% of your Back teaching force, because that's pretty much the number. To the left. And you said it. Uh, an attack has Make lasted a on Don't average mind if about three do. minutes. It takes five to eight minutes for responders for the police to come in. Accident reported ahead. Like taking them away by force from the population. So let me ask you this. Those countries also have Again, you can universal... keep saying that, on, but, but that's that was not, not what look, anybody is calling I'm, I'm sorry, for. I know a lot about this. We ain't perfect, but... Sam? Andrew? Can you open the trunk? Yeah. Let's go. Everything okay back there? Yeah, everything's fine.
Liberty High School? Are you going to Liberty High School? Yeah, sorry, I was just... It's okay. Drive safe. Are you comfortable? Yeah. Yours okay? You want me to turn on the music? No, it's okay. Okay. In 1,000 feet, turn right. Don't do that. Don't do what? Don't turn right. I can give you directions. Oh, uh, if it's all right with you, I'd rather follow the GPS. I have a better way. Well, the GPS also takes into account traffic and accidents and... Keep going straight. All right. If it's not okay with you, I no, can just no, it's fine. cancel the ride. And no, you don't have to cancel the ride. Call another driver. You don't have to do that. You don't have to do that. It's fine. It's, uh... Turn right. It's, I'm, I'm just a little neurotic. Sorry. Um, there. GPS is off. So I'm just going to keep going straight until you tell me to turn. Okay. And you're going to tell me when to do that? Yeah. It's really bright outside today. Yeah, it's really hot. I always prefer an overcast myself. I don't mind it being sunny, it's just the heat. Yeah. And I have a friend of mine who's allergic to the sun. Can you believe that? So are you a student? No. You're not a student? No. Were you a student? Last year. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. I was a super senior. You know what that is? Yeah, it's where um, you do the extra year, right? Yeah, it's where it takes you five years to graduate instead of the, you know, four years it usually takes people. So they call us super seniors. Like, it's a good thing. Like, we're superheroes. Isn't that funny instead of just dumb? Like, shouldn't they call us dumb seniors? I don't know about that. Because wouldn't you want to deter someone from staying an extra year at high school? At least from an economic standpoint. Sure, sure. A drain on the system. You go to college? You like music? It's okay. My brother was in a band. I have a brother that plays music. I had a brother that plays music. He doesn't play music anymore? Well, he's dead. It would be pretty hard for him to play. But, you know, it's funny. It doesn't mean they don't release new music because that's been known to happen. Tupac, Michael Jackson, Cobain, Amy Winehouse, Joplin, Ray Charles, lots of posthumous records, lots of acclaim posthumously. Hey, I'm sorry about your brother. Yeah. But, you know, he joined the army. People told him not to, so you can't be surprised when... And we're not even fighting real wars anymore. Well, I guess they're real in the sense that they're really being fought, but... They're not good wars, so... And imagine all the wars we're fighting that we don't even know about. All the wars in cyberspace. Phishing. Stockpiling data. DDoS attacks, or DDoS. I don't know how you pronounce them. The thing where websites go down. Manipulating elections. Manipulating free elections. Were you close with your brother? You guys talk a lot? We talked okay. Yeah? Well, uh, yeah, that can always be tough when you have somebody you can talk to about anything and all of a... I'm sorry if this is too personal. 
No, you know, it's hard because people say, oh, you can tell me anything, but you really can't. People act like they're okay with everything, but that would mean people aren't like that because people have to have a negative opinion towards something. People act like they're okay with whatever you say, but that's not true. So they're kind of lying to themselves. Maybe what they're saying is that they like that you can say something, but if you think that if you think that um that suddenly they can't have a negative opinion towards that, it, it's almost like infinite regress. That was the thing the philosopher said. You never know if something's right, so you don't say anything. So what do you do for fun? What do I do for fun? Yeah, what do you do for fun? You know, like fun. Just, uh, just fun. Like, uh, what's in the bag? Whoa, why are you asking about what's in the bag? Oh, oh, you know... Are you airport security? No, no, I just, uh, just cause, uh, you know, it was so heavy and you had a hard time getting it in there, I thought, uh, I thought maybe it was lacrosse or something. Do I look like I play lacrosse? You could play lacrosse. Please. You're pretty tall. Maybe the equipment manager. Right. What do you think's in the bag? What do I think what's in the bag? Yeah. Oh, I don't know what's in the bag, that's why I asked. But if you had to guess. If I had to guess what was in the bag? Your best guess. Oh geez, uh, I don't know, you know, I, I guess it could be, um, I guess, uh... I guess lacrosse, that's what I guessed. I help build sets for the musical. I work on the crew. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. I guess. What play are y'all doing? Susical. Okay, so like Cat in the Hat and all that? Turn left. Okay. Uh, you know, you know you can be anything... You know you can be anything... You know you can be anything you want to be, right? What? Well, what you were saying about lacrosse, you know, you, you know, you, um, you're still at that age where um, you can be anything you want to be. Are you my guidance counselor? No, no, I just, uh, just, you know, just because, uh, you know, take me for example, you know, um, you know, if I wanted to start something new, it'd be next to impossible. You know, it's like uh, I'm too old. You know, my, uh, you know, life's expensive, and my, my, uh, my body doesn't work as well as it used to, and my, my, uh, my, my, my brain, you know, my, my. My brain isn't as sharp as it need to be to learn a lot of new things. But you, you know, you're, you're still at that age where, if you wanted to, you know, you could, you could pick up mostly anything. Could I be a basketball player? Well, probably not professionally, but you could play and you could learn to play well. And you know, if you uh, do that for a long, you know, I'm rambling. I'm sorry. But, you know, the point I'm trying to make is, you know what? Forget it. Just up here. Turn left. Down there. Yeah, down there. Oh, I don't think I think I'm supposed to drop off visitors. They don't care. Well, if it's all the same, I'd still like to. It, it's the auditorium's in the back. I don't want to not abide by the. It's still an entrance. Rules of the road, and well, I can just get out right here. No, 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 no. It's a quicker walk from here. No, no, you don't have to do that. You don't have to do that. If it's an entrance, it's an entrance. It's fine. So uh, just up here. Yeah, right there. Thanks for the ride. Sure. Can you open the trunk for me? Huh? Can you pop the trunk for me? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Um, sure. Hey, have a nice day.